Welcome to this Windows and Computer channel and we are talking about computer speed, how to speed up your PC after a certain time. Well, one of the things that uh, you can also do is, first of all, remove everything that you don't use in uh, applications and software. And also look at what starts up with your PC. So we're going to take a look at both of those. First of all, go into your settings go into the apps and check out in the app list what software you have installed that you don't use if you have installed stuff that you haven't used in a long time maybe it's time to actually uninstall them so once the list of apps is actually completed and okay you'll have the ability to click on an app and click the uninstall button that will actually remove that software from your PC. So go through the list and everything that you don't use, you uh, of course uninstall. Be careful not to uninstall things that necessarily that you don't really know what they are uh, for fear of creating problems. So there are things in there that sometimes are related to drivers or software or that's related to some of the hardware that you have, printers and so on. So be careful to download mostly the stuff that, uh, to, to remove only the stuff that you actually have, uh, that you know is going to be pretty much unused or useless. Once you've gone through here, the other thing that you need uh, to check out is what is starting up with your PC. It will have two effects. First, it will have the effect of speeding up your startup sequence when you actually turn on the PC, but it will also help your PC go faster because there's going to be less uh, background processes because the software won't run in the background. So right click in your taskbar, go into task manager and go into the startup tab here in the startup tab, you will see all the software that is starting up with your PC. Uh, what's enabled, what starts up, and what is disabled or not. Um, good chance that if you've never been there, there's almost everything is enabled. So simply make sure that you disable whatever you don't want to start up. So you click on it, and you have the disable button on the bottom right. You can, of course, always enable it after. Uh, another word of caution here when you disable, uh, it, be careful to disable really what is uh, useless. There are software that you know could be useful. For example, I will not disable my Epson event manager because that will prevent my computer from actually uh, really uh, printing. So there are things that you'll want to actually keep enabled, but keep the list of enabled devices to a minimum so that you have the least amount of processes that run in the background. That should also uh, speed up your PC. Uh, it's surprising when you use a PC for a long time, it's surprising the amount of software that might be actually starting up and that can actually be disabled and make your PC faster and boot up faster also. If you enjoy our videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.